Hey there, CJ Math students, and welcome to Math Test Number 44A. We're going to solve and graph inequalities. So, just remember from yesterday that the greater than or less than signs, those have open circles when you graph because they do not include the solution. And then the greater than or equal to or the less than or equal to signs have closed circles because they do include the solution, the number of the solution. So, again, you got a line under it, you're going to have a closed circle that's going to include it. So, now when solving inequalities, you do the same exact process as when you are. Uh, solving equations, the only thing that you need to pay attention to is right here. When you multiply or divide by a negative number, you need to flip the inequality sign. So let's practice. Draw your scales just this right here. Um, and then I'm going to add negative 4 to start because I want that to become 0. I drop down 5x. 5x is less than or equal to, keep the sign exactly the same, negative 10 and then divide by 5. I'm dividing by a positive 5, so therefore I don't flip my sign. So x is less than or equal to negative 2. So not just because I got an, a negative answer do I flip my sign, only if I divide it by a negative 5. So I did not divide uh, or need to flip my inequality sign because I divided by a negative. Uh, my answer er, circle should be closed. So let's put a closed circle right away at negative 2. That means negative 1, 0, 1 on this side, negative 3, negative 4, negative on that side and it should be pointed to the left because the first number that makes this true was the first number that's less than or equal to negative 2 uh, negative 3 so pointed to the left right, let's do another one um, start off with plus negative and then go ahead and draw your scales of justice here we're going to add 7 to both sides so I have x over 3 is less than excuse me 4 uh, I see division, so therefore I multiplied both sides by 3. And again, I multiplied by a positive, so x is less than, excuse me, well, so, uh, be careful, it's not a, d as your answer. So, uh, I did not need to flip my sign, be open, and in this case, again, pointing to the left. So put 12 right in the middle, open it up, 13, 14, 15 on this side. 11, 10, 9 on that side. And again, the first number that makes this true is 11 is less than 12, so point it to the left. All right. All right, now let's do one where we flip, right? Plus a negative. Notice I have a negative attached to my variable, so pay attention. I'm going to add negative 7 to both sides. Uh, cancels off. I get negative 2k is less than or equal to negative 32. And I divide by a negative 2. I divided by a negative. Write that. So because I did that, I need to flip my inequality sign the opposite way. So k is now greater than or equal to positive 16b. So I did need to flip. My circle will be closed. So here's 16 with a closed circle. 17, 18, 19, 15, 14, 13. Uh, it will be a closed circle pointed to the right because the first number that makes this true, what number is greater than or equal to seven, uh, 16 is 17. So going right. Okay, we will do the rest in partners.